ESA's first dedicated mission to study exoplanets, CHAOPS, launched in December and is about to start its science operations. During the last few months, CHAOPS successfully completed its in-orbit commissioning phase and the spacecraft, telescopes, optics, detectors and electronics were all working as expected. The CHAOPS telescope opened its cover in January and in February targeted its first star, around 150 light-years away in the Cancer constellation. The triangular shape is due to the three struts supporting the telescope's primary mirror. It's also deliberately out of focus because the star's light is spread across many pixels to make the measurements more precise. CHAOPS will soon start observing hundreds of stars outside our solar system that are known to have orbiting planets. It will measure the minute dip in light caused by exoplanets as they transit a star. CHAOPS is a small or S-class mission. It was developed by ESA in cooperation with Switzerland within budget and in less than five years and built by a consortium led by the University of Bern. The instrument team in Bern works closely with the Science Operations Centre at the Geneva Observatory. This is where commands are prepared for the spacecraft and where data is downlinked and analysed and processed. The Mission Operations Centre for CHAOPS at the National Institute of Aerospace Technology site near Madrid sends these commands. It operates and monitors the spacecraft and ensures that the telescope's data flows smoothly to Geneva. The observatory is also where scientists discovered the first exoplanet in 1995. Today, there are over 4,000. CHAOPS will observe hundreds of exoplanets that range from rocky and possibly Earth-like to gaseous ones like Jupiter. Its precision measurements will be key to understanding their inner structure, formation and evolution. Scientists from institutes that have contributed to the CHAOPS mission have GTOs, Guaranteed Time Observations. There's also a guest observer program for researchers worldwide. The science mission continues until October 2023 and will expand our understanding of exoplanets and the universe we live in. Five. Subscribe, space, snack.